It's divine. It's so good. <laughs> Happy Dia de los Muertos, San Antonio. Enjoy yourselves. Drink a lot of tequila, a lot of candy, a lot of whatever. Happiness is the most important thing in life. Follow me this way. I got a surprise for you. Wonderful uh, good Dia de los Muertos, baby. And that's Barbara, my friend Barbara. Hello, Barbara. Follow this way. Here comes Monkey Guy. We have everything ready for you. Today we're going to cook some enchiladas and, and, and uh, for a bean surprise with chicken and red sauce. So it will look nice and attentive. Look at that. Look at the sauce. That's red sauce. Esta es la salsa roja. Sí, ok, tomatado. Okay. Le que estoy poniendo esto más. Voy a poner less, less tomate, right there. That's been surprised so you can have horror, horror of dinner. Ahí puedo ir más tomate. Ahí está, ya que se van coloraditas. This is the most delicious chicken enchiladas and tomatadas. Horror dinner for, for been surprised. This is the salsa roja. With a little garlic, a little steamed tomatoes, a little chipotle sauce, and all the all the spices, so it will taste like a, like you in heaven. Heaven, I'm in heaven. See? There you are, there you are. This is a special sauce, Vincent Price style. Caso lo va a tragar él. Voy a echar tantito tomatito este. And this is the salsa roja for the Dia de los Muertos. For Vincent Price style. Me voy a llamar. And we're going to put some more red sauce on top. And this takes two chefs to do it because it's very special. It's beans and price special. And look at that beautiful red sauce. That's from the house of Wex. The house of Wex El Terror. Look at that. I'm going to check on Miguel. Now we're going to go, we're going to go with the chicken breast from Linda Blair. Linda Blair chicken fajitas. Me echo dos, tres, nomás quiero dos. ¿Ha prendido la cosa esa o no? ¿Ha prendido o está apagada? No, no, Look at that, look at that. We're going to cover it up while we make the enchiladas. Don't have the enchiladas. Wait a moment. Take a look at this, yeah. Chicken enchiladas, uh, terror styles. That's Vincent Price, with the tomato sauce. Delicious, mmm, que barbaro. That's the best. We're cooking for Vincent Price style, rest in peace. He used to love Antonio's food because he was also a tremendous chef himself. That's why we're making the tomato enchiladas for him with chicken inside and little spices. Very flavor. You, he's going to enjoy it mentally, whoever's going to eat it. I think you're going to eat it. I know you. Hmm. 
Esto es mi carne, vamos a ver. No le echamos ahí. Fíjate, tu chape más bien. Corte las frutas, así como para chequear paquetes. Cleanest Kitchen en Los Ángeles. ¿Cuál es el vino para que, para que prenda? This is the Linda Blair chicken fajita. Very, very tasty. Look at that. Want to taste it? Sure. Oh my gosh, only needs a little touch of salt. Sorry, Linda Blair. Now we got the salt. Look at the, look at the good looking fajitas. No place in town. Ya tiene el plato lista. Look at that. Linda Blair was a beautiful lady. He came with the guy that made the John Cali made the Exorcist. Great movie, great actress, great lady. And we cook in her way that she likes the chicken fajitas. Very tasty. The little touch of garlic and everything. Look at this. Look at this. Fajitas. Very moisty. Very tasty. Unbelievable stuff. We're going to put a little color in here. Look at that. Two sartenes for two plates. Look at that. Put me a guacamole here. Oh, que majesta, this is for the chicken paquita de Look at that. And now a little flour tortillas and con tortillas. And make it all happen. Make it all go on. Let's touch it over there. Yeah, okay, vámonos. Let's go through the dining room. Ya te lo está muy caliente. Trae uno, trae, 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 trae uno, tú. Trae uno, esos dos. Let's go. We got two cooks to carry the food for Linda Blair and Vincent Price. Do we have? Dígame tú. Don't hold down, please. Don't hold down. Yes. Yeah. 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 This one you make, it happens to us. Put it in, put it in. Put it in. Where is the vieja? Where is the vieja? Vincent Price, Linda Blair. The taste of the tortillas. Best tasty food. What is a beautiful Mexican food without good margarita? And this chicken patitas, I believe, and the chilas and tomatas, Vincent Price style. Look at that plate. Mr. Vincent Price, rest in peace. This was a great cook himself. He was like a chef from New Orleans. Antonio's haunted house. Antonio's haunted house here. Enjoy Vincent Price enchiladas. Let me know how. Try the Vincent Price enchiladas. Yeah. How is it? Wow. I gotta take another bite. Take another bite. Yeah, man. Another bite. You wanna eat the whole plate? Yeah. Look at that. Oh my God. Don't mm. that so big. How is it? Oh, that was delicious. Just melts in your mouth. You got all this. Now take a sip of the best margarita in town. The best margarita in town. No, that's bad. Oh, got some on my nose. All right, you got some on his nose. Now I'm going to try one of my favorite dishes, the chicken fajitas. Made special Linda Blair style. Oh, this is so good. Let's do this right. Another tortilla. Looks so delicious. Ah! Mm. 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 chicken fajitas, Linda Blair style. Come. Wow. 
that's delicious. Chicken fajitas, Linda Blair style, only at Arizona. <laughs> Happy Halloween! Here's a man from the terror of Hollywood, Hollywood terror, Bin, Mr. Vincent Price. And also besides being here, Antonio was a great cook himself. That's why we cook that chicken in enchiladas on red sauce, Halloween style. And here's Linda Blair too. We cook for Linda Blair's, Linda Blair style, the chicken fajitas. Linda there, but she's there when she was a very young lady. John Cali's movie from uh, Warner Brothers. Beautiful people. I worked 12 years at Warner Brothers, so I know I met her there and I met her here. Enjoy yourself. Come, hear your fate if you dare. With knowledge comes peril. So, you must beware. Press the button to hear your fortune. The day, the day that we celebrate the day of the dead, we celebrate the dead with food on the altars and on the grave. We put food on the grave, and the, 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 what they used to eat and they used to like the most. And over here in, in this country, we celebrate the way uh, filling up our bellies and drinking and go nuts and uh, celebrating the streets and show everybody how happy we are. So it's, 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 uh, the only difference is what I, exactly what I told you and what we do. We put the food on the altars and on the, on the grave and put food all over it and sometimes we, we join them and eat around the grave. So hurry up and enjoy yourself. Eat some candy, would you? You're almost as skinny as me.